In this tutorial, we will tell you about the latest features of OneNote. The new version comes with a full screen mode, autosave function, improved table tools, and enhanced scribbling functionality. Once you open OneNote, you will be taken to the new landing page. You will be able to read all about OneNote here. In order to add a new sheet, click on the plus button. You can write the name of the sheet here. You can add texts, online videos, and much more in one sheet. If you press the Tab key, you will be able to add a new column. In order to add a new row, press the Enter key. To use the drawing tools, go to the Draw tab and select the tool you want to use. You can add a color from a variety of color ranges. From the Review tab, you can check your spellings, use Dictionary, change the language, or add a password. The newly added feature is the full page view which can be accessed through the View tab. If you go to the Insert tab, you will be able to insert Excel sheet and online images. Click on the Spreadsheet button and two options will appear in front of you. You can either add an existing sheet or add a new sheet. In order to insert online pictures, go to the Online Pictures button and search the Internet for images that you want to add. If you go to the Backstage view, a purple bar will appear on the left-hand side through which you can access different tabs. To manage your account, go to the Office Account tab and you will notice that now there is much better SharePoint integration in OneNote. They now have separate mailboxes and all the document files that you have stored in SharePoint can be easily accessed from OneNote. To manage your updates, click on the Update Options button, and from there, you can disable, view, or learn more about updates.